Hey folks, the desert artist here. I am here with my uh, my dry washer project. I've gotten to a point where it's deemed necessary to make another video. Uh, I've got the shaker box on and assembled. As you can see, I got it sliding all the way up there. Lifts up. I've got it. Uh, Swing in here on a hook. You see, it swings free. <clears throat> and you can see from my other videos, the shaker box needs to go up a little bit here. Find something to attach that so it stays there, doesn't keep sliding down. You can see what I've done here is I've attached a squirrel cage fan up underneath here, and I have. Oops, I have offset on this side there with some bolts. Let me see if I can uh, zoom. Ah, I, oh, you can see the bolts down there that I put in to offset this pole key so it jumps up and down a little bit. I drilled a hole there and it, I could put the bolt there, but it was too close to the motor. So I had to go all the way to the outside to accommodate this, and you can see that the the attachment to the to the fan is right there on the motor mount. Uh, it's a split squirrel cage fan, so it's entry from both sides. As you can see there. Now I have mounted it on the bottom to accommodate for the lifting of the the lifting of the squirrel cage to accommodate for the weight of the box. I added springs in here to take some of the weight off of the box because well it's it's aluminum and it's kind of heavy so uh mess with a sled on here and the amount of material it's going to accommodate and you can see up here it's well, it's kind of loose let me go around here you can see where i attached this up here where it's kind of the springs are pretty mounted pretty Pretty close, I think. I might have to do some more readjusting there to keep it from hitting where it's hitting right up there. I'm still engineering this thing, so I got the little attachment on the screws, springs down here, attached to the bottom of the squirrel cage to help with the lifting process that happens. What I have, so. Here's uh, <clears throat> what I've got so far, and uh, let's see, I'll show you the, there's the top part of my, my, I still haven't worked that part yet, so I don't even bother to show you. I've got the this is, I'm going to use these, these are off of a aluminum slides off of a, an awning, I'm going to use somehow to accommodate for the the lifting of this here with my ore chute there down at the bottom pouring into the sled there uh, so you can kind of see what I've engineered so far and I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna I'm gonna plug it in so you guys can kind of see how it rumbles around get too loud start bumping against stuff against some still some fine tuning in there but you can see it pulls your air through there and it rumbles around and shakes uh, there we go there's uh, part three what I got so far hey thanks for sticking around be safe bye